In Affinity Publisher 1.8 and above, you can play spreadsheet data from apps such as Microsoft Excel, Apple Numbers, and LibreOffice Calc uh, directly into your publisher document uh, using the place command. So let's take an example of when we want to add, say, financial data for an annual report. And we're going to use this example here on this spread. And we want to kind of leverage that uh, primary data source um, from the you know, accounting information and present it into the document rather than having to recreate it all from scratch in an actual table. So we can do this using the place command. So you can place either directly onto the page as a table, or you can place the table in line into the text frame. And we're going to do the former first. So do file place. And we'll choose year on year here. And click open. Incidentally, this is an XLSX file. And this XLSX file is, uh, the, is the format that we support for all spreadsheet data import. So now I've brought this table into the right-hand spread, uh, I can actually mo modify it and uh, change the properties of it as a table. And you can see on the right here, the table uh, panel, and that's accessible from this option up here on the context toolbar. And I can change the cell uh, left edge, just to make some fine tuning for presentation, and also, on the right edge as well. I'll be able to select cells via the table tool and change the fill accordingly. Okay, so that's a, a, a table added standalone. So let's look at adding a different table. So I'll just come up to this point here on the left hand spread. I'll just hit return there. And then I'll place a secondary table, which is uh, year 2020. Again, it's an XLSX file. And it pastes the table in there. And I can adjust it. and. And the same principles I can edit it and modify using these options here. Back up to the table and then select cells and modify accordingly. There we go. 